So, we are playing the Irons once again. It feels like we've only just played them recently. Oh, we, did. Yes. we beat them, didn't we? Someone remind I'll me of the score at the Amex. I about that. Someone yeah. remind me of the score. Uh, 2 or 3 0. 3 1. 3 1. 3 1. 1. Yeah. 3 1. Antonio scored a boomer. But are you confident that we could get another win? Or is he at home again? We love beating them. At home? We are there. But is it at yeah. home? It's away, isn't it? Shit, no, it's away. Yeah. Oh my God, I'm useless. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I was going to yeah, say because I'm going to the this... I'm going to East London. I should know this. Yeah, no, yeah right. I mean, he's going to the Amex, mate. Trust me. This, yeah, this game, <laughs> this game's away. But you're you're, yeah, you're thinking about the three one. We beat them at home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well. Oh, yeah, right. again, okay. I reiterate, it's, um, it's nine a.m. Um, yeah. but yeah, um, obviously we are we are their bogey team. Ryan, are you confident that we can continue that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. I I never fear West Ham whenever we go into them, and this might come back to bite me, but it never seems to happen in the last five or six years. Um, and I, I don't think that's going to change. I think we're still a good team. I think the West Ham have actually been a bit poor. I, I mean, they had a decent game against Forest, but they're very wasteful. Um, yeah. You know, I think that we're we're both pretty similar teams, really. With us and West Ham, I, I put us on the same similar sort of level. Um, so yeah, I'd say we've we've got every chance of beating them. I think we probably draw if I'm going to predict it, but I don't know. Uh, I think we've I think we've got every, every chance. I mean, we're Brighton these days, and, and we can take on any team in the league, you know. So we can go to Manchester United away and come away with a win. So why can't we go to West Ham and come away with a win? Yeah, true. Yeah. They did look lacklustre against Forest. Did you watch that game, Maz? What? Yeah, I, I, I actually did. Yeah, I caught up on all the, all the games this weekend. No, I've done my my mm. uh, my. I love I love basically coming. Uh, I came out from uh, my mate's birthday, and I literally just sat there on YouTube and watched every game. <laughs> oh, uh, probably, I, I love I love I love love that that. Do, 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 do. Uh, yeah, it's no, but yeah. You, you, wait. Do you say West Ham look lacklustre? I didn't think they looked yeah. unbelievable against Forest, did they? Man, they battered Personally. them. They battered them. Yeah, they yeah, they, yeah, they were all over them, but like yeah. they weren't very, no, yeah, very yeah, yeah. Well, pressing. They didn't really. Yeah, they they were very I, wasteful in front of goal, and I thought they would. They to be honest, for West Ham's usual standards, they weren't yeah. very. They, they, I they thought should, they were going to go to I that mean, and beat him. They, yeah. sh- they should have won. They should have won. They well, that Declan Rice missed a penalty. Oh, yeah. They had multiple chances where Henderson made some top class saves. To be fair to him, yeah. Uh, and then there was just a few they were just a bit wasteful at. But I thought Ben Rama really impressed me. I thought Ben mm. Rama looked really good. Um, four nails was good. Yeah, four nails. Like he, Ben Rama was involved in a lot of the action. Um, and then, yeah, th- th- I mean, look, West Ham, they are a team that's sort of like just, they're consistently staying in the same sort of position, if that makes sense. They're not really challenging for top four. They're not really, you know, down there. They're in a sort of that little, you know, that group, that that, that pack in the middle mm. of the table where yeah. just sort of like they're being consistently okay. <laughs> uh, but with our, with, our re- with our record and our history with them recently, I, I'm I'm confident going into it. Like, why why, why can't we be confident? We've we've beaten Man United. We've we've got a pretty good result, and we with a better team against Newcastle. So going into this t- going into this game, there's no reason why we shouldn't be confident. Mm. I know it's maybe away from home, thought, but maybe it's thought of West Ham too highly against Forest. I, I know that it's like Forest's first game at home. I guess that probably played a lot. Oh, 100 percent. The, the vibes. That's the first Premier League the, home game for like 30 years or whatever vibes. it was. So yeah, the Forest vibes. Yeah, so going through, into it, though. I thought West Ham are going to spank them, but obviously they they no. didn't, and I kind of understand why they wouldn't have. Yeah, yeah. And, and in all fairness, in, from my when I watch like the high, I, to be fair, I only watch highlights. But from you looked at all West Ham and like they missed the penalty, you know, multiple saves from Henderson. Like they look much the better side. So yeah, it wasn't, they're it definitely wasn't like, the better team. I yeah, just don't yeah. think that you know. Bear in mind they're playing no disrespect to Forest, but they're playing Forest. I just think with us, we're we're a good team. We we'll control the game. Uh, we'll go there. We'll, we'll control possession as we always do. Uh, I think that. I think it'll be a draw uh, if we want to do predictions there as well. I think it'll be a draw um, just purely on the fact that it's away. Um, so any point on the road is a good point, right? Um, so yeah, I think a draw. But I'm going to be sitting in the West Ham end, by the way. So that's going to oh, be weird. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, because I've got a tickets off Copper um, because they're doing this thing with Budweiser. So they gave me oh, some nice. tickets. Um, oh, yeah, I always I mean, I, I have to be in the home yeah. end. So, yeah, you, yeah. You, you might be with Moses. Um, right. I know Moses Duckrell from Copper. Uh, and he okay. always he literally goes to so like he was at Brighton on the weekend uh, oh, I think I Copper see. just sort him out tickets for like every yeah. game basically. looks like I've got their, that privilege this year which yeah, is yeah, important yeah. hopefully so. yeah nice um, but yeah I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll you know I'll, how it goes I'm going to try, <laughs> try and get down there as well but uh, Ryan I'm, I'm going to try and get a ticket uh, yeah, so it's literally like, well, it's like ten minutes in the West Ham end, if you want. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm going to try. Yeah, obviously, it's like 15 minutes away from me, so yeah, might as well. Yeah. If I don't get beaten up by a West Ham fan, then or spend seven pound fifty on a pint, 
Um, yeah. but I don't, I don't oh know my god, that's horrendous! Yeah, <laughs> god, it's all those prices for safe. Do you remember when we in a way in? Do you remember? I, I actually moaned about it. Do you remember when we went last year and yeah. uh, I went and got I bought a pie and a, and like a soft drink and I was like, this is ridiculous. Like, yeah, even that crazy. was expensive. I'm not spending yeah. money. I'm not spending yeah. money. Can't be done with so, it. Ryan, what was your prediction? Did you say? I'm going to say a draw. I'm going to say one all. I think okay. that. I think that that's probably about right. Okay. Um. I think. I don't. Yeah. I reckon it could be one nil to Brighton. I reckon we might nick it. I, I'm going to be. Po- I'm going positive. to be. I'm going to be positive as well. I'm going to go two one Brighton. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> I hope you're right. <laughs> It'd be a bad day I, I, out of it. That's just a very positive, <laughs> positive mind frame. But uh, yeah, yeah I, I, there's no reason why not. Um, yeah. I think it might be too early for Estepinian to. I know the club haven't announced it, but it looks like it's literally all but done. So I, I think well, it might Kukurea be too early. Well, Kukurea came straight in, mate. Didn't remember against Leicester last year. He was straight yeah, in the true. team. Um, true, true, never true. Never know. If he's good enough, yeah. he's in the team, right? I don't know, but he looks like good, good enough to call it. Because uh, maybe Baron, the let's, start. let's say he flies in. Let's yeah. say tomorrow. Like if he flies into to Brighton tomorrow. To well, apparently he's flying in today, Maz. So yeah. oh, okay. the Brighton well, stalkers on Twitter are saying. Right. Um, apparently the ones, he's the ones who check all their flights. Flight that, trackers. Yeah. Yeah. Flight trackers. Yeah. 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 Okay. Well, so yeah. So in theory, if he comes in today and then trains from let's say tomorrow or Thursday, then that should give plenty of time for him to start. Yeah. So yeah. 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 And he's yeah, probably been keeping fit with the Villarreal side. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, we'll see alright then so let's we'll hope see. we do win and beat West Ham away not at home Ben Jesus Christ that's really embarrassing